The Grand River Black Music Festival and Conference is Ontario's very first black music conference, and it's designed for emerging artists and people who love the music industry and want to work in the music industry to get the information that will teach them about their brand and how to access business information in regards to music that they can't get. We're teaching them all these tools beyond the microphone that they can't access anywhere else. Black Music Canada is a a national organization which seeks to celebrate the impact and legacy of black music and black music makers in Canada. Uh, We felt this organization was necessary because there was a dearth of sort of appreciation for uh, black music and black musicians, especially historically. And so, you know, we make it our mission to recognize these artists, celebrate their impact, and also support the emerging artists that are coming up on the Canadian music scene right now. Um, We are partnered with this wonderful festival, um, you know, to showcase the talent of black Canadian artists. And I think this is really representative of the network that can be developed um, between those who appreciate and love black music in Canada and those who are trying to take it to the next level. So on Friday and Saturday, we have conferences until 5 p.m. and movie screenings. So we have um, Michael Williams from Much Music, Master T from Much Music, Will Strickland. He started Bad Boy Records with P. Diddy. DJ Ron Nelson, he's the pioneer of black radio and essentially the pioneers of hip hop who started hip hop in Canada. This festival is an absolute must for this region. I think... The first thing is that, you know, I'm from Toronto. I'm here today in Kitchener for this festival. So there's an economic impact. Um, There's also the artistic side. Kitchener has a burgeoning and growing um, music scene and specifically black music scene. And I think it's important that we're able to galvanize these people. So this is a tremendously important event for Kitchener. Canada has a lot of talent. But if we don't nurture that talent, um, it goes south of the border. And I think a lot of people have the idea that I have to go south of the border to be successful. And I think that's tragic in in sort of the Canadian landscape. Um, And I think it's a story we can change if we're active um, and we're focused on supporting homegrown talent. We are bringing famous people here that have never actually been together and now they're going to spend an entire weekend roaming the streets here so there's that but also it's the fact that artists can access them at any time at this conference to get advice to be able to say hey i would like a one-on-one how do i do this with my career and they will stop and they will talk to you that is what they are here for we already are talking about how we're going to grow this out next year and, and who else we can bring if you want to learn more about black music canada you can visit our website which uh, is namely blackmusiccanada.com, and we'll provide you with any information that uh, we can, which will hopefully be helpful to your career. Support black music across Canada. Support all Canadian musicians across Canada. We really need to let our artists know that we love them.